Hey Sharks, I'm Angie Scalona. And I'm Danielle Link. Today we have a very, very special episode of WSRK. This episode of WSRK is our 100th show. All members have been working non-stop this entire year to reach this point. To kick it off, we question our Sharks with the man on the street. We then have the seniors of WSRK speak about their favorite memories. All this and much more on this 100th show. Get ready because WSRK starts right, right now. Good morning, Sharks. WSRK is very special to the members, but I wonder what others know about the program. Well, we have Justin take the streets and ask Sharks what they know about WSRK. I'm Justin Skolnick here in the Alonzo and Tracy Morning Senior High Cafeteria, seeing if people know what WSRK is. What is WSRK? I don't know. Uh, isn't it that, that program where you guys do weekly where it gives like info about the school or about certain events? I don't really know. The uh, filming it, uh, class in our school. I have no damn idea. Math club, something academic. It's, uh, the shark, it's the news for our school, you know. It's taught by a bald man. His name is Mr. Fernandez. Oh, okay, nice. Have you ever seen Mr. Fernandez? Yeah. Okay. This year? Yeah. Alonzo and Tracy Morgan, Senior High School uh, News Broadcast Show. What do you think WSRK stands for? The world. Well, well, I don't know. World Shark News. A little louder. World Shark. You're going to have to be a lot louder. <laughs> world Shark News. Yell it. I don't even know. You <laughs> You want to tell me? <laughs> World Shark News. You're wrong. What does it stand for? I don't know. You don't know either? No. Alright. Oh, WSRK. World and Shark Real Knowledge. Good enough. Today we learned that more than one person actually knows what WSRK is and that nobody knows what it stands for. I'm Justin Skolnick reporting for Get Ready For It. WSRK. Shark News. So, with the majority of WSRK students graduating in just a few days, the program will literally be passed down to you guys. Well, I know the underclassmen are ready for the challenge. Let's see what others have to say about the future of WSRK. So this year in WSRK has been absolutely amazing. We got a brand new teacher in the beginning of the year who we got along with really well. We went to many competitions. We won a lot of local, district, state, and even some national awards. And we all just got really close as a family and I was so happy to be a part of it. WSRK allowed me to become friends with a group of people that if you asked me a year ago, I'd never expect to become friends with. I didn't think I'd be involved as I am right now. Yeah. I thought I'd be more of a casual member. Kind of like the office, like I might be one of the, you know, others, like I might be a Toby maybe. It's kind of in the background, like he's there for most episodes, but not every episode. You know, but like not one of like the Jim Dwight's, you know, or Michael's or Pam's, you know, it's kind of there. Many of the people in WSIK are seniors and it's going to be a bittersweet goodbye, but I believe that we created a bond that's going to last a long time and I'm so excited that and happy that I'm a part of it. You know, I hope everybody, like the remaining members in WSRK, like work together to make it more successful. Next year, I really want to branch out WSRK. I really want to get some of the freshmen, some of the sophomores to really join the program. And I want to find the kids who really have a passion for TV but don't know it yet. And I want to bring them into the program. I want to continue going to all these competitions. I want to win a lot of the national awards and just really make our program better. Though we have to take over WSRK, I know the seniors are probably emotional about graduating the program. Well, WSRK did do a lot for all of us. Check out what the seniors have to say about what WSRK means to them. Uh, 
Uh, that's a that's a really hard question to answer. What does WSRK mean to me? Um, I'd like to think that's a very tough question. Can I say everything? Because WSRK has literally gotten me through high school. It got me into college. It is everything to me. It means a lot. I mean, okay. To me, WSRK is a way to share my passion for journalism. It's a way to show my creativity. WSRK, has an accident ever been so impactful in my life? WSRK, it means many things. I mean, one thing is it means Eastern, East Shark, not Eastern, East Shark. You'd think maybe West because it's WSRK, but it's East. West is with a K. K W S R K. Nice. Whoa, well, bagels? God, where do I begin? Um. Well, for starters, um, WSRK was where I met some of my best friends that I honestly would have never thought I'd be able to interact with, let alone communicate with. For sure it means opportunity, because I got to do so many things that I never thought I'd be able to do. I got to work with PBS, I got to do uh, cover events and go behind the scenes of all sorts of stuff. I got to be a part of things that were a lot bigger than me. WSK for me started just as like a filler class in the elective, but I actually ended up really liking it, so I ended up doing it for three years. But we're kind of like a messed up family. It's like a family. We're all a big dysfunctional family. WSRK changed everything, not only my career path, but my life, the way I do stuff, the way I have an outtake on life. The mistake of placing me in TV1 and joining WSRK ended up being the best mistake that I've ever had to go through. What does WSRK mean to me? To me, it's one of the greatest forms of expression you can have at a school like this. Some kids have their art classes, some kids have bands. Uh, I had TV production, and I'm very happy to have had this class because if not for this class, I would be less of the person I want to be, and because of this class, I'm growing more into the person I want to be. I don't know how to thank everybody at WSRK and anybody who's ever been a part of a video we've made, anything. Uh, I don't know how to thank you guys enough, because without you, we wouldn't have anything. Um, so, thank you. And I will never be able to watch a movie the same way again, that's, that's for sure. So many things happened these last couple of years. Let's watch a video about these special events throughout the past four years and what we as Sharks are saying goodbye to. Four years, 720 days, 4,320 hours, 259,200 minutes, all leading up to this. June 5th at 3 o'clock, I'll walk across that stage, shake a couple of hands, and my time at ATM will be over. I'll have to say goodbye to a lot of things. I'll have to say goodbye to the halls I called home. Say goodbye to the teachers that made it fun. Say goodbye to the friends I've come to love. And say goodbye to it all. I've done a lot during my time here. Every minute working to the goal of one day saying I made it. Every all-nighter, every broken heart, every bad day, every tear worth it. People ask me if I could go back, what would I change? But my answer is always the same. Nothing. If I could give a freshman who's about to walk through those doors a piece of advice, it would be this. Make the most of every second you have, because you'll never know when your time will run out. I've learned a lot during my time here. Be kind to everyone, not because you can, but because you should. Be spontaneous. People will always talk about you. Might as well give them something to talk about. Be the photographer. Take lots of pictures and videos because they will be what you cherish the most. And smile and actively try to make other people do the same. Do the most you can with the time you have because someday soon you'll be walking across that stage shaking some hands and your time will come to an end too. 
four years, 720 days, 4,320 hours, 259,200 minutes, and then it's over. Hey, you. Me? Yeah, you. I have something to tell you. You do? Yeah. Well, what is it? What is it? Well, why didn't you just say so? I think you should join the Sharks Television and Entertainment Club, where many students just like you can make all kinds of videos. Not to mention, we've also won several awards and plan to keep them coming. And the best part is, we sell bagels. Whoa, bagels? Yeah, bagels. So what do you say? Yeah! Sharks TV and Entertainment, for a televised tomorrow. Alright guys, come on, we got a show to start. 40 seconds. Intern, mic me up. Let's go. Clip it on. Let's go. Let's go. Where is my script? I wanted it five minutes ago. Give it to me. Come on. Well, where's my flip cereal? Huh? I want it on my desk. Come on, come on. Give it to me. Let's go, let's go. We got a show. Now that's better. Available in two flavors, chocolate and dulce de leche. Visit flipsusa.com to see where Flips is available near you. Flips, the best is inside. Well, that's it for this episode. And for the school year, Sharks. We want to thank all of you guys for supporting WSRK since the very beginning. Signing off, this has been Danielle Link. And for the final time, this has been Angie Escalona for WSRK Shark News. Shark News.